Hi there, this is Maria here with the Art Journal. How are you all doing today? I hope that you're being blessed, that you're surviving the holidays. What I'm doing today is a short video. I want to fix this background. I don't know what I was thinking. I think it's hideous. I remember I did this maybe a year ago and I remember having fun, throwing paint around, enjoying my supplies and I love that little bird that I created for it. However, the more I looked at it after I was done, I thought, what in the world? What was I thinking? I think it's pretty hideous. So I want to give it a nice soothing blue background and I made a boo-boo here. I added too much white. I don't like that because it's a waste of paint. I didn't need to do that. But I am adding some old tubes of paint that I have had for like six years sitting around and they need to go. So it's a great place. Our journals are a great place actually for us to, to just dump all the extra stuff that we have that we don't use and have some fun with it. I am adding also some Payne's Gray to make a dark background. I like it because it gives it contrast, the bird pops on it, and also this background complements the page on the left very well. It calms things down. What I am trying to do here is extending the image of the bird. That bird is sitting on a branch originally, and so I am creating a tree that is going to go into that image and I am using some white gesso and a thin brush. I try to use a jelly roll but it seems like those pens uh, don't work that great. Uh, many times, many times I have a hard time with these gel pens. Anyway, I like that effect that it gives that nice pop of contrast right there. I am just adding some extra highlights here in the original image with the white just to bring the image and the background together. I would like to apologize. I have not posted a video in a long time. I have been taking some art classes and they're really kicking my booty. Um, they're pretty difficult for me. They take a lot of time. So I am not going to be able to post videos as often as I would like to, but I would like to try to do it at least once a month. So please come back to check that out when you get a chance. Also, if you like this video, remember to give it a thumbs up because that really helps push the video out to many more people. We can inspire them with the arts and crafts and also with the Word of God. I'm just adding some contrast here with a black Sharpie pen. I think that bird is looking pretty cute there. This page was originally about Romans 12.12. 12. And um, it talks about rejoicing in hope, being patient in tribulation, or suffering. Some versions say that, and that's what I had originally used. And also to continue in constant prayer. So I am going to be writing down here what I originally had written down before. Be patient in suffering or tribulation. Um, I encourage you all to focus on the Lord, have your hope set up on Him, look up to Him, continue in constant prayer and fellowship with Him. Because by doing this, I believe we can exercise that patience that the Lord would like us to have in times of need, in times of weight, in times of suffering or tribulation. Anyway, I hope that you have enjoyed this little word of encouragement and this very short video. And I hope that you will all be very blessed. Have a wonderful Merry Christmas and that you come back and see me next time. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.